guys Phoenix here and today we are building Jake from Adventure Time so this is right next to the Finn one and I basically just built that one and also if you're seeing this on two separate occasions they're built on the same day the videos are supposed to separately but anyways let's jump right into this for this tutorial we're gonna use black wool snow and yellow stained clay and just make sure you have this on deck just in case this is a um, splash potion of swiftness just in case if I decide to fill anything in so first off, what we're gonna do is just put one piece of black wool on the floor, and then we're gonna go up and to the right from it, one piece of black wool, like so. From there, we're gonna go up and to the right, six vertical pieces, oh my God, I'm terrible, <laughs> of six, um, six vertical pieces of black wool, so one, two, three, four, five, six, like that. Then from the bottom block into six, we're gonna go down and to the right, three flat, like so. And from the top block in the six, we're gonna put three to the left. One, two, three. So this one, the three are actually touching it and down here it's at a diagonal, as you can see. But we're still not done with the six. We're gonna count up from the bottom or down from the top. I think you can count down from the top, I'm not sure. Actually, no, we need to count down from the bottom. Up three, so one, two, three. So this third block right here. And we're gonna put one to the left of it. If you count it from the top, you have to count down four. See, one, two, three, four. So it's this third block right here. We're just gonna put one to the left of it. From there, we're gonna finish this part off first because it just connects to there and then we can just do other stuff. So from this one single, we're gonna go up and to the left, two more singles. One, two, and that's it for this little corner piece right here. We can go back to this part right now or down here. But for now, I actually want to do the down here part because I want to see how wide he is. So we're going to go up and to the right, four vertical pieces of black wool. One, two, three, four. From there, this top block, we're going to do two things. We're first going to put three pieces of black wool to the right of it. One, two, three. We're going to go back to it because we're also going to go up and to the left from it, two vertical. One, two. From that two vertical, we're gonna go up and to the right, four flat, one, two, three, four, just like this. And to close the shape now, we're just gonna go down and to the right, two vertical like we have right here. So it should look like this. And you can actually just fill in the center now with black wool, like so. Next, what we're gonna do is, you see this bottom part right here, where I'm swinging at, we're just gonna put three pieces going down below it so it's even to what we have on this side see so there should be a two gap right here and from there we're going to kind of mimic what we have over here so we're going to go down and to the right three flat one two three then up and to the right four vertical again one two three four now from that four vertical we're going to go up and to the right three flat And with this three flat, what we're gonna do is we're gonna use this to shape out the eye. So from the right side on this three flat, we're gonna go up and to the right, six vertical. One, two, three, four, five, six. And like I said, I wanna see the corner of Jake to see where he's gonna end off at. So before we do this, cause this is gonna loop around to do his eyeball, we're gonna still come back down to the bottom of it. So this bottom block right here, switch over to the clay and we're gonna put one below it, like that, a second below it, then one to the right, so it looks like an L. Then we'll switch over to the black wool, and we're gonna put two black wools going to the right, just like we have right here, like this. Now from the right block in the black wool, we're gonna go down into the right, three vertical, one, two, three, down into the right two vertical and you should be touching the ground so one two perfect so this is the end of Jake right here but we still need to loop this around and make it touch back over here so we're gonna go back to the three vertical we have right here and on the top block we're gonna put one to the left like so we're gonna put one to the right like that and from that one to the right we just placed we're gonna put five going on top of it so one two three four five and if you count them all it should be six high because we had one originally and we put five on top of it so now let's go around to doing the roof of the head 
So from there, we're going to go up and to the left, two vertical, one, two. Up and to the left, three singles, one, two, three. So, so far, your pixel art should look like this. We're then going to go up and to the left, two flat, one, two. Up and to the left, nine flat now. So make sure you count everything carefully. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And now it's time to bring it down. So from that nine, we're gonna go down and to the left, two flat. Down and to the left, four flat. One, two, three, four. And we're gonna mark the left and the right block in the four flat we just placed, because on the left side, we wanna go down and to the left, one single. And on the right side, we want to go down into the right, one single as well. And from this newly placed single, we're going to put one to the left of it. And we're going to go down into the right from it, two vertical. One, two. Now after we do that, we're going to go back to the left side, so where we have this single right here just waiting. We're going to go down to the left from it, seven vertical pieces of black wool. One, two, three four, five, six, seven. So I met, up what we had, uh, I met up with what we already had, which is what I wanted, and it should eat, um, add up to seven. And now it's time to fill in the eyes and stuff so that we can just get the finishing shape. So first what we're gonna do is, let me just knock out this placement block. We're gonna go back to here and finish this, and then we'll make, um, make up for any lost space. So from this two vertical, the top block, we're gonna put one to the left of it. And on the bottom block, we're gonna go down into the right, three flat. One, two, three. From that three flat, we're gonna go up and to the right, two vertical, one, two. Up and to the right, two flat, two times in a row, one, two, one, two. Let me just recap real quick. So we have three flat, two vertical, two flat, then two flat again. From that second two flat, we're gonna go down into the right two flat again. So it should meet up with what we already have if it, we did it correctly. One, two, and it did. So all we're doing is missing the base of the eyes, which we can do that right now. And it should be fairly easy. Sorry for the pauses, guys. I'm sweating like a pig. But I'm, I'm gonna record these tutorials for you guys because I have to. So we're switched to black wool. And what we're gonna do is right here where we have this four strip, the second block, we're gonna put one black wool above it. And the fourth block, we're gonna go up and to the right, two singles. So one, two. From there, we're gonna go up and to the right, two flat, and it should beat up with what we already had, which it did. So now this eye is complete. All we have to do to finish this pixel art is make this eyeball meet up over there, and we'll do that right now. So first, we're gonna go down here to the left of our yellow blocks, or whatever these are, yellow stained clay, I think, yeah. So we have these three flats. We're gonna go up and to the left from there. Well, are we gonna go up and to the left? Um, well, actually, let's put one block to the left of it. So now it's four long, so let's count them out. So it's four long now. Then after that, we're gonna put one block on top and then add three to the right of it. So one, two, three. So it connects to what we already had. It's like another layer. So if you're wondering what we did right there, I'll just redo it real quick. So it looks like this. We just went up one and then brought it to the right, to the right until it touched the wall. Then sticking on this corner right here, we're gonna go up and to the left, two singles. One, two. And now just to complete this pixel art, we're gonna go to this two vertical right here and put one below it, or you could just add it a third single. It doesn't really matter. And now Jake's complete. So we're gonna fill in first his eyes with the snow. So let's do that. And let's listen to the sound of my beautiful voice while I fill it in. So, um, like I said in the Finn one, I don't know which one I'm posting first, so I'll just recap. Um, I will be doing the Five Nights at Freddy's in rotations, and rather than just busting all of them out since Five Nights at Freddy's just came out. And I know like by the time I'm done with them, the hype might be over, but they'll be in rotation, so maybe some of them will be um, made in the correct time. And hopefully, all well, everybody enjoys all of them, and they'll come out in a reasonable amount of time. But I really can't just sit here and make only Five Nights at Freddy's. Like, it makes me not want to record the tutorial time lapse. 
like as you can see I haven't even finished Chica yet and Chica was um, supposed to be done like a week ago oh, whoops I forgot so once you're done with the eyes you switch over to the yellow stain clay and everything else is gonna be yellow stain clay so just fill it in real quick but yeah as I was saying like when I build too much of a certain genre of pixel art I get really bored and that's never happened before because usually I had um, a lot of variety but the Five Nights at Freddy's has too many characters and it's like I need different parts for them and it's just it's just really a lot to do so it's like even like Gravity Falls which I've done like five pixel arts on I haven't gotten tired of or tired of or Pokemon it's just really a lot of Five Nights at Freddy's kills me so I'm gonna slow down on it and put it into a rotation and once it comes back around I'll just have like a time lapse waiting and then a tutorial for you guys but I will try to do all the animatronics there we go so there's Jake the dog's face you can have him on your pixel art map or you can just put him on your survival world and it's just a really easy and small pixel art tutorial maybe it took about 10 minutes and just like the Finn one over there and now we got Finn and Jake together so thanks for tuning in guys this is Phoenix and as always I'll see you guys later bye